In this video, I will demonstrate how to load and view a seismic cross-section in INT Viewer. First, let's open an index segwi file. We can quickly view the EPTIC table to find out the grid corners of the survey and also open the binary header to access additional trace information. Since this file is already indexed, we can choose either a cross-line or inline view, the specific line we want to start with and the step at which to increment views. This cross-section shows a monocline with an intriguing amplitude anomaly on top. We can change the horizontal and vertical scaling of the image to fit our fancy and also choose the best type of trace display. I like the lobe color fill because it adds more texture to the amplitude variations. INT Viewer has a beautiful high resolution rendering of seismic traces that you can fully appreciate when zooming in. It's easy to add new synchronized windows to test display parameters and other attributes. I've added a window here, tiled it vertically, and I'd like to also edit its display properties. We can change the name of the layer to something meaningful and test various ways to normalize the traces and choose a new color scale. We can use any of the preloaded color bars or easily design our own. Stay tuned and subscribe to our channel to learn more about what you can do with INT Viewer.